Bills try to be a little bit ahead of the curve in the NFL and kind of like anticipate trends that are going going to be happening. Um, and I, I, I don't know how quickly it'll happen. I don't know if it will happen, but I, I kind of feel like the NFL is going to have this shift of going back to, you know, heavier personnel, uh, the running game being more featured and, it's for a couple of reasons, and we've seen some of them with the Bills themselves. Um, but one being, you know, just the success defenses are having of like with the cover two shell, kind of like an almost full time prevent defense type deal going on, um, where they're just not allowing explosive plays. They're allowing you to cut, uh, like catch the ball underneath, come up and tackle. Um, we saw the Bills kind of at the forefront of this type of deal um and just like limiting the explosive plays um lighter linebackers you know more emphasis on the pass game um so you see you know a shift back to two tight end sets and you know a, a more aggressive running approach and we we saw you know one of the most aggressive rushing offenses over the back, back half of last season under Joe Brady um my other main reason for this is with how much the passing game exploded in the NFL, like it, it's no longer enough to have, you know, just that bona fide number one receiver. You need a, a threat at number two. You need depth throughout three and four. And, and like, you need all of these guys to, to be affecting the pass game. Um, and when you see like the talent necessary to have that and what these wide receiver contracts uh, are starting to do I think there's there's just got to be kind of a, a shift in the philosophy because um, right now you're already kind of stretching the budget to be paying one of these top guys when you see you know Jefferson just got you know 35 million a year 150 plus guaranteed um, and when you start having a roster that has like two of that caliber receiver like you'll get by paying one. Um, hopefully you have a franchise quarterback and then you got to pay the second receiver. And all of a sudden you're talking, you know, half your salary cap is going to be tied up between three players. Um, and I think if the league just continues on that trend, like something's got to give eventually. 